Hello guys, welcome in a technical biology. Let's dive in with practical in this video tutorial how to impose or how to use a color on any playlisted song spontaneously. How you will arrange chronological order of BPM length and key of any songs from your playlist. So, first and foremost, guys you need to click on this local musics now you have to choose on a local music here you will have a desktop click on here you have to choose a PC in PC wherever you have a selected or you have saved or capped music file that you need to select so in a especially PC, I have selected in a C drive on a download option in videos. So now see it. Now how I have imposed or used color with chronological order this BPM. For whatever song that you have selected here guys and this list suppose here total is a 55 songs you need to click on this bpm and you have to make this arrow that should be similar way yeah this one you can here yeah, have the much space also to make a more visible spontaneously you can deaccelerate and accelerate increase or decrease this length areas BPM areas now see guys this is a upper side arrow so this is a here yeah. ascending order now see when I will scroll down we will see the much more more and more size of BPM length everything when I would like to descending order now see here with descending order so this is a BPM why I am telling you about this BPM quickly suppose here I'm playing this 80 BPM this songs this is 80 so now what should be next so that should be 85 hmm? because this is only one more than 5 bit uh, this so of course we can load it and a little bit we have to match this patch and after passing quickly we can play these songs so here this is for arranging or for management of BPM ascending order or descending order guys now how do you give a color how do you use a color a specific so we will click on a tag editor we will click on a non color and of course we will use according to our increase size is not desire any color suppose I have chosen the red one this one here if you would like to rename of course we can suppose here now see I would like to rename so I will click on ok so now see it's renamed and of course now see this is a once again if it is not much more visible than we can change this color so now once again let me select this blue yes now it's totally visible now see it's totally visible now suppose here see if it is a similar BPM then from one day to another when I will replace from one day to another songs from A day to B day there will be no any gap up that I have replaced one song and I have played another song suppose let's see here
so see you guys here it will assist you because it's eating directly we can go on up here uh, if I let me arrange this uh, ascending order now see it's a 80 quickly we can use here 85 so if I reload this 85 here yeah, let me so now see it has quickly matched and when I place this song from this ones suppose I was playing this song here let's see now see here So see guys, without gap up actually I have a played and quickly suppose this is a 80 once again I will go here so if I, if I select here 90 90.0 90.7 so this patch will be less how much more or how much less it's costly 5 to, 5 to 6 points so definitely this song will be matched BPM will be quickly of course quietly master of this one so that's why I was uh, trying to convince you just arrange these ones this will really assist you to select quickly from one song to another without matching much more a struggle to match the key of from one deck to another so this is all about in this video tutorial if it is informative and acknowledgeable then please Push the button of subscribe and like and set up this content because this is a thing that will inspire me to make more and more such as informative video and maybe beneficial those who are highly interested to have this, this kind of the information. Thank you. Thank you very much.